so are you nervous because you haven't played volleyball in a while? I mean, do I really have to get naked for this? Yes, absolutely. That's part of the I deal. mean, that's what that's what we are playing this week. We are from MyGamer.com. Go check us out. Put us in your favorites. MyGamer.com. You can follow me on Twitter at Zach Gaz. And this is Retired Men's Nude Beach Volleyball League. This is a real game. This is not made up. This is not some, you know, I don't know, hack of a game or something. This is a real game that you can buy on Steam right now. At the time of the stream, it came out yesterday. And it is like a $7 game. And right now it's on sale for 10% off. And when I got this press release, I <laughs> I think, you know, what your initial reaction is like, what? Like WTF, like this is crazy. Why, why would anybody make a game about this? So I'm like, we have to play this. We have to stream this. This is crazy. Let's check this out. So we are. And he has a long inner monologue. Um driving yeah. there so this game i should read the description because you, you like you, i think you, your mind can go places just by reading the title of the game but it's not it's probably not what you think so uh take to the court and match up against your opponent in physically and mentally challenging beach volleyball this is a single player narrative based volleyball game set in Massachusetts. Join the league and play as Len Rizzo as he navigates the later part in life one serve at a time. Hey, Len, I'm Mark. Thanks for showing up. It's going to be fun. Point. No good. Finish that. There you go. Oh, out of bounds. Oh, he still hit it. There you go. Switch him up. Switch him up, boys. Are, are, do you aim at all, or does it just nope. go automatically? There it just is. goes automatically. And you have to play to 25, which seems so much. I don't understand. Like, you got to hit the uh, the serve at the at the peak or in the middle. What what's that bar? Uh, it's the power bar, so you have to hit it. Kind of full uh, at blast. At the high, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. This is, I mean, even though we got to go to 25, it might not be that long because everybody, this is just point, point, point. This is not a back and forth volleyball game. No, and it's, it's, it's hard to like see the shadows kind of. Yes. So this game is made by the same guy who made Soda Drinker Pro, which is also just a ridiculously weird game. It was on PC, and then it, and then I reviewed it when it came out on Xbox many, many years ago. It was like when Xbox One, almost like first launch, maybe like a few months after launch or something. So I remember Doesn't it, was like it like when weirdly came... change into not being about for <laughs> soda? Yeah, so correct. So th if you never played Soda Drinker Pro, it's made by just, I think it's just one guy who made this game and Soda Drinker Pro. And... The game, so, so I mean, I don't even know how to explain it, but Soda Drinker Pro, the the visuals are like a seven year old scribbled something in Microsoft Paint, and those scribbles became 3D objects. So it's like it's kind of like this, where it's like a, like there's these weird 2D sprites in like a 3D space, and it just looks weird. You know, it's like intentionally bad, very very plain and simple, like just using the paintbrush tool, like nothing fancy. Like not even straight lines or anything. But anyway, Soda Drinker Pro is the same way. It's this ridiculous game where all you do is you just spawn into a world. And it's like a first person shooter, but instead of having a gun, you have a soda. And it's been years since I played it, but it's like, you know, you hit the right trigger and the soda like straw like gets closer to the screen as if you're drinking it. And all you do is you just drink this, you just hold the right trigger or the right bump or whatever it is. And then you just walk around these really badly drawn on purpose 3D environments. And that's the whole game. So it's like you just walk to the exit 
and it's like all right level two and it's like now i'm drinking drinking uh soda on the moon next level is like drinking soda in how an does that count i hit it three times you hit in it, a row and you hit it under the under the net well they say in the beginning uh the first time i read the uh rules they he said i i don't care if it goes over or under the net <laughs> it's so yeah so clearly this game is just built around humor and not caring point mark Marks that yeah, that's, I'm Len. that's yeah. Then Soda Drinker Pro, you play a level, and then if you if you enter a secret door, then the game just opens up and becomes like a crazy mini game compilation, almost like a WarioWare kind of. It's so weird. It's like the weirdest game that like nothing makes sense. There's no rhyme or reason to anything, and I I got like almost all the achievements, if not all the achievements in that game. And just seeing this game here is like, yep, you could tell the same dude that made Soda Drinker Pro would make <laughs> this this ridiculous weird game right game. here. Yes, so weird. There yeah, go. finally got nice. it back. Nice. You got to get the you got to get the rhythm down, the timing. Switch serve. Oh. And I was also So we had to do that... a switch serve and then a change serve. Yeah, I'm not sure. But even though this game is, you know, about nude old old guys, you know, it's it's there's no junk involved. It's just like ridiculous flesh colored blobs walking around and i was assured that this game will not get banned on twitch or youtube i guess it's been cleared that's what i heard that's what i was read that's what i was given so we'll see i think that it's funny that the ump or the ref in the back has no just pants wearing on. wearing a shirt with no pants super weird and the grill in the back kind of looks like a virtual boy Oh yeah. Oh, oh right in the corner. I thought I, I was sure that was gonna go out of bounds. Oh you got a bunny. I wanted to play with the bunny and not. There it is. Yes, yeah, smell it, Mark. Look him up. I mean one on one volleyball is such a boring sport to begin with like you really got to play a two-on-two -two to like make it anything even at a barbecue yep and it's like so if you're playing one-on-one -on -one volleyball chances are you're just gonna like kind of hit it back and forth you're like you're, you're not like a ref doesn't need to be involved like you could probably keep track of your own score it's fine coming back he was a good kid I what is he even thinking about I don't know At a point. oh that Who's guy I know that guy I guess You got in trouble for something mm. that when you were children. Mm. They said it was a narrative based game. That's out. Smell it, Mark. I like the really bad one frame of animation when he hits the ball. Green oh, yeah, hit, no, He's just done thinking. He's like, yeah, I don't need any more of that shit. 13. What was that? Who won? Oh, switch him up. All yeah, right. he got it. Tie, tie game. I mean, isn't volleyball up to 11? Yeah! 
and this is 25. Yep. Which I guess. Is a lot. I guess. Yeah. I guess retired men's beach volleyball just plays by different rules. I don't know. Oh, you're reconnecting with your friends. With no pants on. Yeah, I was thinking that too. Well, I mean, if there's a way to reconnect with an old friend. It's not this. It's with no pants playing volleyball. That was no. a bad serve, Mark. Yes, he right there. He said it too. Bunny's back. Bunny. Yeah, now's the time to focus, huh? Both doing well. I don't know what to tell you. It feels um. just from the dialogue options makes me think that there might be yeah multiple endings it well in the beginning he was talking about you could either it was something about a mall or the time that he got scammed into a timeshare and like you can either you can either um like, you don't have to say yes to the timeshare. Like, you can keep saying no, 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 no. <laughs> of course you can. No good. Yeah, well, I had no control over that. Out. No Is it on the line? Yeah, it's just not a nope, apparently not. No good. <sighs> He's gonna stick through the whole season. I wonder how many games that's gonna be. Oh, oh point. God. I guess that was on the line could see me I bet she would be surprised I'm sure a lot of people would be surprised I, if they I, saw you. you know yeah this has been fun it's been fun playing against you it's really great catching up pretty surprised that I'm here I'm, I'm sure that's the way that everyone feels when they're playing volleyball nude. Oh, oh that counted. Yeah, he, cause he said in the past he doesn't care if it goes under mm -hmm. the net. Mm -hmm. Okay. Oh, that, that was out? I thought that was in. I, I would have... I would have sworn that was out. Mm-hmm. Oh, nice grab. Yeah. I'll be fine, I'm sure. I want to see what happens after this game. I'm, I'm really curious now. I want to see where this goes. Just focus on the game. Oh. In, in the corner. Look at that. What a shot. Yeah, switch serve. Yeah. I, I, that was out if I hadn't hit it back. Right. Well, who knows? Because the depth in this game is fucking weird. Shit. I don't think. Yeah, the 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 boundaries don't. Really well, and it's it's sense. like so hyper saturated. Mm hmm. Yeah, you can't tell anything. Yeah. Same 
it. Okay. Oh, there it is. Game. That should be no, game, right? No, because he serves. Oh, Sango. he serves. Okay, yeah, yeah. Dogs should play volleyball. Yeah, why don't they? I will a thousand percent agree that dogs should play volleyball. That is the truest thing this game has said. <laughs> oh, is that out? Yeah, it's very Oh, he's giving... Oh, bad. Okay, yeah. All right, here we go. Snakes. I don't know about... I mean, I would watch that, but it, not as much as dogs. Here we go, 25 points. Take care. Point. Len Saving, Len wins. Yep. Let's see what happens next. Off to Worcester. Thai buffet. Ooh, I would like to go to a Thai buffet. Never been to a Thai buffet. I don't think I have either. Um, entering Worcestershire. <laughs> yeah, it's not spelled right. Even Massachusetts in the description isn't spelled right. <laughs> Steve. What do you think so far? I want to see. Keep clicking. I want to. I want to get to the to the next match. I just want to see. Okay. Like. Like the structure of the game. So you know, I guess you play a match. You and you get can some go inner, through memories and stuff. You, you, yeah, you get this inner monologue. And then. And then it's back to another match. Yep. all the other opponents even if the rest is scared of him deep breaths do your best let's get this look who it is uh, I would say that I didn't leave an impression but that's impossible it sounds like something has been keeping up with mental exercises get ready for the heat how do you even know I use there's a lot I know about you Len now get ready for the heat all right, sir. What do you think? I think this is. Uh, <laughs> I'm I'm curious to play more. Like I, it's a totally different approach to a like it's a volleyball game, but that's it's just a cover for what the game really is, which is just like almost like a visual novel. Yeah. Right? Just with some like some bad intentionally bad volleyball mechanics in between. So I'm just curious to see like where this goes. Like, does this guy like make friends? Um, are there multiple endings? How long is the game? You know, like how many matches until like the season ends or something? How does it end? What is the ending? So I think it's totally ridiculous. That is the point. And I would be curious just to see just what happens next because it is so outlandish and so bizarre. All right. So... so yeah, you could follow us at mygamer.com. <clears throat> Go there, check us out, put us in your favorites. We are covering games that really no one else is playing, like Retired Men's Nude Beach Volleyball League. Go check that out. It's on, it's on Steam. It is available now at the time of this stream. You could follow me on Twitter at Zach Gaz, Z-A-C-K-G-A-Z. And until next time, thank you for watching and game on.